another short series of Qigong videos. In this series, the Qigong we're going to be learning is called the Eight Pieces of Brocade, or the Eight Brocades Qigong. More commonly known in Chinese as Ba Guan Jin. It's a very old form, I think it goes back about a thousand years. So it's very well known, very commonly practiced. This form of Qigong only has eight moves. Each move repeated three, four, three times, five times, eight times, twelve times, or twenty-four times. In, this, in these videos I'll be repeating it twice only to keep the video short. In addition to these eight moves, to start the form, I add on another form of Qigong posture called Embracing the Tree, also called the Post. Now this form is to enable us to relax, to settle down, to prepare for the Qigong. What I'm doing is my feet are not quite parallel, my toes are pointing slightly inwards. I want my second toe to be looking straight ahead. I push my knees out like I'm sitting on a horse. I bend my, I soften my knees. My posture is absolutely straight. I bring my chin in. I'll turn sideways so you can see that. And what I do is I want my back to be rounded and my chest to be slightly concave. So I raise my arms, drop my elbows, my fingertips are almost touching. I turn my thumbs out, my little finger comes in, and I settle there. Now I try and hold this pose, or I do every day in fact, I hold this pose for four, five, six minutes, depending on the day. I would encourage you to try to hold this pose for at least a minute. This will really prepare you well for your Qigong. Right, now we're going to start the first move. The first move of the eight pieces of brocade is called two hands holding up the heavens. I bring interlock my fingers as I breathe in. I start to stand up turn my hands and I press up as I breathe out and I'm leaning back slightly I look to the front breathe in and breathe out again as I sink my knees or bend my knees I prepare by interlocking my fingers I breathe in as I slowly stand up Turn my hands, breathe out, lean back slightly, look to the front, breathe in, and breathe out. I'll do it one more time. I start to interlock my fingers, I breathe in, I turn my hands, press up to hold up the heavens, lean back slightly, Look to the front, breathe in, and breathe out. So I'm going to do that from the back. Try to follow me. We are over here. And I'm holding the, embracing the tree. I'm ready now. I open my hands, circle my arms. I interlock my fingers, breathe in. As I come up slowly, turn my hands, press them upwards, lean back to look at them, look to the front, breathe in, and breathe out. Sink down, interlock your fingers, start to breathe in as you come up, turn your hands, and breathe out. Look to the front, breathe in, and breathe out.
The second move is called drawing the bow to shoot the hawk or to shoot the eagle. It goes something like this. I finish the first move. My left hand crosses my right hand in front. I breathe in to find my balance. I lean over to make a step and I sink down and with the out breath I shoot the eagle. I look this way, bring the right hand in front and breathe out and shoot the eagle this side. I look this way and breathe in, left arm in front and I shoot the eagle. I look this way Bring the right arm in front and I shoot the eagle. Finish this and I stand up to go to the next form. I bring the left arm in front as I breathe in to stand up. So we do the next form. Let's do that. I'll turn around. Do it with me. Where am I? I've come down here from the first form. <coughs> from the first form, I've come down. Left arm in front. I breathe in to find my balance. I take a step, sink down, and shoot the eagle with an out breath. I look that way. Right arm goes in front as I breathe in. And I shoot the eagle. I look this way. Change left arm in front. As I shoot the eagle, I breathe out. Look this way for the last time. I breathe in, right arm in front. And breathe out. form, I breathe in, left arm in front, I stand up, and I'm ready for the next form. The hand positions, the, 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 the hand pulling the bow is just like you have two string fingers on the string of a bow, and you're pulling it back. The left hand, or the hand holding the bow, you can keep it relaxed like a good Tai Chi hand, or you can keep it relaxed and point the forefinger up, but not tensing it. Pointing the forefinger to the front, or upwards, upwards, or you can just have a relaxed hand. For now, it's not important. You need to learn the, the sequence, practice Qigong, and you will start to feel you can do it in a very relaxed way, and you will find where your hand should be when it is most relaxed. Let's do that from the beginning to the end of number two, and we do it two times each. Also, I will be embracing the tree, although you won't see it. I will do it for about 10 seconds. Let's start from the beginning. Breathe in. And embrace the tree. Start the first move. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out. Breathe in. 
second move. Get ready to go into one leg, breathe in. Lean over. Change. Right hand in front. Thank you very much. See you in the next video.